Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for November 24th, 2021. Let's see. Oh, oh, hi. Okay, that's the one we just had yesterday. It's right? Full moon in Sagittarius, see the bigger picture? Refer to the yesterday video. <laughs> Let's get a fresh card. Okay. Michelle, you can't do that. I can do whatever I want. Okay, and I will. Where are we at? Are we on Wednesday? It's tomorrow's Thanksgiving. Okay, and we have New Moon and Leo shine. See, when we start to unlock ourselves from really a mental prison and even an energetic prison, which has been going on for quite some time, <laughs> you know, we're believing that things have to be competitive. We believe that we have to shut down our emotions in order to make it in this world. Uh, we believe that we have to get one over on somebody. You know what I mean? It's disgusting. Don't you think? I think it's gross. <laughs> but <laughs> this is you finding your true center and in shining in the way that is authentic to you. So, sorry, I'm hold it like this. So really what's happening is you're finding your power, you're finding your self-esteem, and it's not in an arrogant way. It's not in this self-centered kind of way, but rather, I don't need to take it, okay? Or I want to do this project and I have a practical plan in place and I'm going to do it. I don't care what other people have to say about it, <laughs> right? It is saying it's my time to come on out and express in the way that I know I incarnated in this body to do. I know I came here to create. I know I came here to communicate. I know I came here to help others. I know I came here to be the organized one because people seem to get so rattled at being organized, but I'm good at it. You know, whatever it is, what do you have to offer? How can you show up to help balance something out? Whatever that might be, right? And some of you, yes, you are going to be, why am I putting this behind me? <laughs> I got the deck in front of me. <laughs> a lot of you are going to be stepping up and maybe kind of saving the day a little bit. Someone's going to have a great idea, but you know, use those little moments to remind yourself, yeah, I have worth. Of course I do. Of course I'm wanted. Even if you are one of those people that you're surrounded with toxic, toxic people who are scapegoating you, who are trying to constantly lower your frequency. They're trying to constantly bury you in their problems, right? I'm not talking about somebody who complains a lot, who might be in pain and might actually need some help. I'm talking about um, the more general idea of how, you know, if you don't, have this kind of money, then you're nobody. If you don't carry this kind of handbag, then you're nobody. This materialism, right? So that's what I'm talking about. Like that, um, having us not believe in ourselves or saying, if you don't know somebody important, then you can't get through all that kind of stuff. That is the kind of thing that will hold us back from our progress. And now we're in this place where we can be free of that and say, that's nonsense. If you have nice things, that's fine. But that does not make you better than me, <laughs> right? Or what have you. When I lived in New York, you know, if you carried a coach bag, people were like, <laughs> look at you. That is so middle class of you to carry a coach bag. You know, it was ridiculous and judgmental. And I think the whole idea here is to unplug from that kind of nonsense. And if you're somebody who does that, if you find yourself judging someone because you do think that we're using the example of materialism here, but if you think that materialism does in fact put you above others, I don't know about y'all, but... I don't know. <laughs> I tend to stand back from anybody who might start to put some judgmental energy uh, out there. And I know it's difficult because then we want to judge them. You see the thought form? You see how it kind of bounces back and forth? So let's see if we can catch ourselves doing that and correct it. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.